What's up, I'm recording this in the same night. Hello, hello, hello. Too tall here. Come to the search bar to bring you another video. When we last left off, um, not the best of air attacks have happened. If anything, I would say we've failed a few. If not, almost. Well, I say almost all of our attacks. That one attack was just disastrous. Oh, fuck. And again, that's, I blame that on me. So, yeah, but to make up for it, uh, Chicago, I guess, caught this transport. I don't know where the other one is. Because it did take a while for Chicago to go, go from here to here. But... She's right there. And that's funny, this is off of radar contact, not visual. Well, within range. Yeah, so it says our radar can be uh, for 13 to 13 kilometers. So, so this is visual. Well, let's get a better firing solution as it comes up. We got our HE loaded. Part of me. That's the best we're gonna get. Chicago, you are clear to engage. Life is gonna suck for you, buddy. I think I just saw the shells. Oh, they're back there. Yeah, but you're gonna wish those uh aircraft sunk you. Chicago, you can do better than that. So, so I'm thinking the fourth cargo ship is somewhere over here or over here. I'm actually going to change course a little bit. Both sort of closing the range while at the same time getting a more favorable angle. That actually startled me for a second. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck me. <laughs> startled by my own goddamn gun blast. And that's why I don't play scary, scary? Uh, scary games. Chicago's there. Can you stop missing Chicago? It's just a transport. It should be easy for you to hit. Well, I say that. You see me try and aim torpedoes and silent hunter. I can't hit for shit. Well, we are straddling the ship, so. There's that. Oh, 
you're almost in range. Or in a firing angle. Hmm. Can I speed up time? No. Okay. I should. You're gonna see. Should. Damn. Yeah, if I were the crew on this thing, I would have abandoned ship by now, actually, because there ain't no way you're outrunning a Chicago. Well, it's a Northampton class, but we're calling it a Chicago because it's the Chicago. The only good Chicago. Splish splash, I was taking a bath. Do 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 do. I'm gonna be taking a bath here real soon. Ooh. I wonder what the difference are between these. Go for full. See what that does. Oh, she now has a rear gun firing. Ow. Hmm. I like how you can see in the distance. Yay! We got ourselves a hit. Oh, thinking that was an ammo on the for the forward five. Well, that hit right where those five-inch guns are. So, well, those look a lot more like the twenty-five instead of five-inch. But it says it's armed with five-inch. So, now we'll just do this. This is caliber, twelve point seven centimeters. Yeah, and I think those are the anti-aircraft guns. She did take bomb, close range bomb hits earlier, so. Oh, secondary guns opening? No, it's just the main gun. So those are 8 inch shell hits, so. Each hit, it's gonna do some damage. Yeah, I am using high explosive because these things have no armor. And I'm pretty sure an armor piercing shell would slam right through the entire thing in one hit out the other. Uh, it could also be possible if the ship is big enough, it may activate the fuse, but not quite sure. Our solution is getting better. I think after I sink this ship, if I don't detect the other one, I'm just going to end it. Get some decent hits now. And we are closing the range. Slowly. Well, we're gonna be opening the range here soon. Come on, Chicago, you kicked the shit out of some Japanese heavy cruisers. This thing shouldn't be a problem. Second, go for full volleys. Hmm. Oh, shit, that was a close one. 
Okay. Now fire. Fire full volleys. It looks like we're... Just... No wrong button. Ah! I hit... Oh, hey, every button but fucking end. God damn. Fat fingering the shit out of that one. Come on, Chicago. Oh, I think I turned too much for that rear gun. I wish I could speed up time. I mean, this guy is going to pose no threat. I'm bringing an 84A6 solution. Should not be missing this much. <laughs> We're in 88 now. 86, 88. There we go. I mean, grant those shelter in the air by the time the things have updated, so. Next round should definitely start hitting. Out the fire. I'm actually gonna s switch to armor piercing because we're actually running out of shells here. Actually, the rear gun is only. Say, so why? I completely forgot that this ship did recently engage in a surface action, so she doesn't have that much ammo left in her main guns. Alright, secondary guns, though, she's got plenty of ammo in those. I think I might just have to let her go. I think I'm gonna unfortunately <laughs> with an ammo set like this. I mean yeah, your rear gun's almost out of armor piercing. Well in that case I'm actually gonna have Yeah, you're out of armor piercing. I'm just gonna have Chicago then just make a beeline close in, make every shot count. Actually hold fire for a second. Get you in a lot closer. Yeah, I, they, I completely forgot she had a surface. She recently had surface action against the Japanese fleet, so of course she wouldn't have that much ammo. She sunk two heavy cruisers. No, well, at least if when we get in range with the five inch. Those 5 inch 25s. I mean, granted, they're only 5 inch 25, but as a cargo ship, should do stuff to it. Can I speed up time now? No, still can't. The solution's a lot better. I'm gonna wait till I get 94, 96. Yeah, so. Should probably definitely return to the new. I can't remember the base down there. Should probably. Actually, I wonder can I go to the Russo Island and rearm there? Two ninety four. 
Okay, you may resume firing. Switch to HE. Yeah, so if anything, we actually need to. Well, I do have a Fletcher here, but for some reason she just won't disengage from battle. Oh, you still have plenty of 5 inch ammo left. Now your torpedoes. I've noticed that some ships, when they have that second launcher, they just their torpedoes aren't loaded. No, oh, that was a close shell. Oh yeah, 94, 90, yeah, you, you should definitely be hitting with your shots. Chicago! Don't make me compare you to the automotive industry. <laughs> Okay, that one I can't blame you. That was just dispersion. You're just really unlucky, aren't you? Let's get the rear gun into play now. Just because of how close we are. Get another three guns in play. Yeah, turning's gonna fuck up the uh, solution here. I should also give these five inches time to sh open fire as well. these wrong one 16 we're in range he could be shooting back and we got we got the highest solution you can get but we should start landing hits constantly Granted, we don't have a broadside to shoot at, but still. And those hits are, are hitting very close. Which, if anything, would be doing damage to the hull. Hey, two five-inch hits. Okay, can we get some eight-inch hits? We are getting. I, I'm pretty sure those are hitting below the water line. Oh. Like it looks like she did hit with the last of her main guns. So, yeah, we're, we're running low on ammo. And I'm not going to have Fletcher come all the way up here. Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, if she don't sink from this. Oh, she's turning. Oh, her engine's dead in the water. I think we managed to get her engine. Nope, can't speed up time. And I wish I could speed up time. 
I mean, I should. And we're at the last point where these two sank. And we're not picking up the other ship on radar, so... Or visual. Where else are a lot of shells coming in? For just 5 inch. Okay, that rear gun is also shooting, so... Please sink. You've got to be done for. Come on. Okay, those are looking good. Sink, you bastard. Just give up. Go down. I mean, granted, I've seen fucking ahead of my personal play through USS laugh. You just take hit after hit after fucking 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 hit and just decided not to sink until the very end of the battle. I mean, this game does damage. Thank you. I mean, this game does damage control exceedingly well. This one, next to, like, Silent Hunter. This is one of the best damage control systems I've ever seen. The bridge is still damaged, which I love. But, like, fire can spread, and, like, these spaces, you can pretty much ignore if they're f on fire in favor for other spaces. It's... I like it. I like it a lot. Like, I think it's done really, really well. I mean, you can order counter flooding and everything. Sunk, sunk. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Not, not, I don't know where the hell it went. But yeah, 15. Okay. RTB, if you would please. And, uh... Ronell Island, if it's called. Yeah, Ronell Island. It has supplies. If not engineer. So, sh So, we might be able to rearm. Within 13 miles of a friendly port, rank 3 or above. Okay. That's only rank 1. So never mind. You have to go back this way. So we're, we're sending the ships back there. That's because, I guess, ammo. Plus, Enterprise does need more aircraft after my uh, blunder up here. But with 33... Should we build 39 of these damn things? What? X what? I'm... Can someone explain to me what the heck Flint vi this Vincennes X Flint is? Houston X Fix... Oh... Uh, okay, never mind, I... <laughs> Never mind. Houston got sunk and same with Vincennes, which was a uh, New Orleans. The USS Vincennes, she should be. No, she gets sunk the 13th. No. Fuck. First battle off Guadalcanal. I can't remember, but yeah, no. And you lose Vincennes, Quincy, Astoria, and uh, you also lose the uh, Louisville and Augusta. <laughs> A lot of these ships end up sinking right here. Uh. 
And I don't want to send my... I don't want to park ships over here. But I'm going to have to if I want a Guadalcanal. So let's see. 22. That would leave me with 11. I'm actually gonna take. I'm actually gonna turn this from a. Well, do I want? I mean, for for being ASW for task forces here, they don't do much. Yeah, so you know what? I'm actually gonna change this up, since really the ASWs mainly come from my planes, and not these destroyers. I'm going to change things up. I'm going to create a uh, sur heavy surface task force. And so for ships, I'm going to want uh, for my surface. I have Portland. What can I get for a light cruiser? Can't. Actually. Eighteen plus eighteen is no, can't do that. 14 plus 14. Okay, 20 plus 20. You know, actually. You know what? I'd be okay with getting two broken class cruisers. Wait, 29, 30. One, two, two, thirty, three. That's five. Four destroyers and two Brooklyn class cruisers. That is no slouch for ships. Not at all. Not to mention their surf air detection radar is fucking amazing. Decent five inch belt. And if, and if you ever seen what the Brooklyns could do to a fucking cruiser close range, take a look at this. <laughs> when they came to the Savo Islands, fucking look at Drakenefell's <laughs> fucking <laughs> one where his U.S. Sent, where his, yeah, two Brooklyn class cruisers, no fucking slouch. Okay, well, let's speed things up a little bit. Damn, those fuckers are flying down here. Now oh, I need this. There we go. I'll actually have them meet the two destroyers over here by this base so they can actually keep something covered. Really, you can go this way. And you'll actually finish off the rest. Enterprise, then her task force. They're going home. Oh, shit. What do we got? Oh, thank God it is. <laughs> Greenlings, oh, what the fuck? What the f- Where did you come from? Where the fuck did you fuckers come from?
What the fuck? Oh, good news is they're not going to ever detect this fucker because it's at C State 6. Plus the rain. Oh, but there's no layer in it. Oh, it's actually relatively sh uh, deep here, actually. Yeah, make your depth. Uh, take her down. Engineering, electrical. Where the fuck did you guys come from? Okay. Oh, I'm glad Enterprise is going away from this place. Wait a second, I know this fleet. Triple torpedoes? Wait. No. Okay. No, this is a different fleet. This one's a lot less deadly than my personal playthrough fleet, but it's. I'll. I'll bet you these guys are carrying troops and. Well, they're not carrying supplies, I can tell you that much. Well, the Tone class here may. Fuck. Okay, well, really, okay, stop going that way. My bad. Well, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> well, if there's any ladies watching this, um, <laughs> I think Japan, guys. <laughs> <laughs> is uh okay Japan I'm I'm impressed now okay Japan you uh make sense wait these things have Sonar? Damn. No, t no to self. Oh, well, the birth doesn't, but the county class heavy cruisers have sonar? That's interesting. I could get those if I wanted to. But, uh, yeah! Okay, Japan. Can I save? I can, okay. Well. I have to get ready for bed and other things. So you can after this, yeah. Um, would you kindly slow down the? F you hear the cold water theme or cold water noises. Uh, yeah. Okay. I don't know how to spot, but yeah, that's. <laughs> That's a bit of <laughs> a yeah. 
Well, I can show you how overpowered torpedoes are. Wait for this to get to ninety-nine percent. We are well within effective torpedo range, and yeah, they are hauling. That's about as best I can get, really. I turn on radar. Oh yeah. And this is where the overpoweredness of the torpedoes come for, come in. They uh, after getting a ninety nine percent solution, <laughs> they <laughs> get spread out to perfectly strike. Well, it's not a bit of a. Thing. And this one's only going to have two torpedoes able to be launched here. Got a ten Ryu. I think those might actually m maybe miss? I'm not quite sure. We really can fire two more torpedoes. I am so glad I put. Okay, yeah, no, those are the. This is gonna be a dead heavy cruiser here in a few seconds. Um. Maybe. Maybe. Well, we're going to clip the rear. And those are going to miss. Okay, well, they're pinging for me. And they are... I know they're not going to find me because... Well, I mean, Japanese ASW is terrible already. Probably should have put a spread on those, but, uh... Oh, those looking. Um... Bad. However... <laughs> the ship's gonna get hit again! Uh, if you... He's running to that ship and... Ah. Oh, I didn't know turning out only had three propellers. What? What is this madness? What is this technology? Uh, you know what? Maybe they can detect me. Dive. Gonna start the retreat here. I'm pretty sure that ship's sunk. Yeah, how do you like it? <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I might I might try to be an asshole. I'm gonna be an asshole. Does the tender you have depth charges? Oh, she does. Oh, she does. Okay. Um.
I am actually going to try and eyeball this. What? No, I want this one. Thank you. That was a good eyeball. Oh, are you fucking serious? That was right under the keel, too. And who says Silent Hunter doesn't apply to other games? Nobody. <laughs> Reestablish. Yeah, this fucker took a torpedo hit right to the bottom. Can I shoot still? Too deep fire torpedo. Okay. Yeah, okay, let's try and retreat now. You would think that would snap the fucking kill of the damn destroyer. Which, in all out in reality, it should. Uh, did I know the tenor you had? Sonar. Oh, it doesn't have sonar. Huh? Uh, which one is this? And uh, that is a ten Ryu. It says she has tor uh, death charges, but I don't see it. Well, I see the death charges, but I don't think they're modeled. I would say I'm amazed you're still alive, but they were all in the same spot, so. You, I don't know how the hell you're still alive. Let's try and get out of here. Oh uh, yeah, no, you're. I'm pretty sure you're. You're. The hell. Could just be the ocean too. Oof. Moderate. Well, flooding is heavy. Okay. Um. Oh, we don't have the aircraft for it. I'm gonna end this here. This is too tall saying thank you for joining me. Japan really fucking stepped up and I'm quite glad I started this thing. The only downside is I don't have any heavy cruisers with it. However, I'm thinking with the Greenling here. As long as the weather stays like the way it is, and I think it will, we can make this Japanese formation, uh, well, we can make them regret life. I mean, we can end them of that life soon. Uh, 
Gato. I'm actually going to have you come down here and rendezvous with Greenlee. And create a dual submarine task force here. Because that would be nice. And with that fleet there, I'm going to have to wait before sending this to Guadalcanal. Oh, that's a problem. You know, something tells me that these transports weren't that important because they have an airfield on Guadalcanal. And Enterprise no longer has any aircraft. I think the Japanese just played me for a fool. Hmm. Well, we're going to finish sinking the cargo ships over here with, uh, or at least attempt to finish sinking them over here because while that Japanese fleet definitely had troops and there's obviously were another transport group somewhere here these still have a lot well I say they still have a lot I think they're down to four transports now so and I mean they're I mean, theoretically I can have both of these uh, if I wanted to come here take the troops from here which probably might not be the best idea and then sent or actually how many troops can these things hold yeah no uh, cargo yeah no I'm not going to take the troops from here but I can definitely send these guys down here and then send this fleet up to Guadalcanal bombard it and then have this fleet unload the troops and everything and then capture the airfield and hopefully since they have an airfield one they may have done the work for me yeah I'm thinking I might need to rethink my strategy here and definitely get this airfield up and fucking running because they may only have four fighters, but uh, it's still four fighters that they can use to shoot down my aircraft and scouts. And use their fighters as effective scouts, because I've seen their fighters chew up destroyers. So, yeah. Oh boy. Anyways, enough of this. This is Too Tall Saying. Thank you for joining me. Stay safe. And as always, have an awesome, awesome day.